The city of San Diego is considering a plan to close Point La Jolla year round. That closure could help protect sea lions who use that area to rest and give birth to their pups. Fox 5's Christelle Kumwe joins us live from La Jolla with more in the specific area we're talking about here. Christelle. Yeah, exactly. Good evening. Now, Point La Jolla is the rocky area behind me between Boomer Beach and La Jolla Cove. Now, city officials plan to close it because they say it's a plan that's been coming for two years. They've been trying to get people to stay away from the sea lions. Now, the plan in question was introduced on Tuesday, and it would extend an annual six-month closure and extend it all year long. You can find many signs like these along the concrete wall at Point La Jolla. There's more signs there saying do not approach the sea lions and no selfies with sea lions, but it happens every day. But Robin Davendorf, chair of the Sierra Club Seal Society, says many visitors ignore them. We had taken photos and videos of people approaching sea lions, touching them, throwing rocks at them. Uh, and it just uh, was pretty horrific. She shared some of those videos with us. A lot of times people put their kids right next to the sea lions to get that selfie. Don't realize that these are 800 pound wild animals and it could really cause harm. Wild animals that sometimes bite to protect their pups. Last year, in an effort to protect people and sea lions, the city introduced a six-month closure at Point La Jolla from May 1st through October 31st during sea lion pupping season. <laughs> that didn't work, so now they want to close Point La Jolla year-round. The ocean access people can access the ocean for spearfishing and body surfing, and the general public can view these wonderful wildlife from the boardwalk. Point La Jolla is the area between La Jolla Cove and Boomer Beach where sea lions go to rest and give birth. Only that area will close to keep visitors and sea lions apart. So it's really, really a win-win situation. Again, plans to close Point La Jolla, La Jolla permanently or not set in stone, and the public will have a chance to weigh in on the matter in a public hearing. However, as of today, there are no hearing scheduled just yet. For now, live in La Jolla, Christelle Kumwe, Fox 5 News.